Well, everybody, it's the same old dilemma that I've had since I started collecting vinyl again four years ago. Which outer sleeve to use to protect the albums? I'm a believer that uh, if you have a good collection and you really want to take care of it, you have to have outer sleeves. We'll take an album plain like this and uh, you want to protect it. You want it to be safe from dirt, dust, water damage, coffee stains, or anything else that you might encounter. Uh, what's the best outer sleeve? Now I've gone back and forth on this forever. Uh, a lot of people seem to want to use these, which are thicker. This is uh, three mil, I believe. And I get the, the names, you know, the plastic uh, confused, whether it's poly this or poly that, but you know what it is, that they are. Um, this is the most common top loading sleeve. And what I like about these, you see both of these, these outer sleeves I'm going to discuss have their advantages and disadvantages. What I like best about this is, first of all, it's, it's thick. And, and to me, the thicker, the more protection you'll have. But what I like about these is when you get an album, you can just slip it right down in there. And there you have it. Okay. Now the only thing is, the top is exposed. And this particular bag I have is, is not the best example because I also don't really care for these types of bags that are very close to the top. I mean, I have ones that are raised a little bit more than that. But if you happen to be flipping through your albums, if you have your albums lined up like this, and you want to go through them like this, you're going to be scuffing the tops. You're going to be, your fingers are going to be touching the tops of the records. Okay, now I don't really have to worry about that problem too much because as you can see over here, I have all of my records on shelves. So I don't have to worry about it. I pull them out this way. Okay, now that's that's the one bag. Now you're talking about the resealable flaps, which have advantages of their own. Uh, the first thing is, look how clear that is. This may not be the best example. This is a used sleeve, I think, and it's kind of dusty. But ordinarily, there's a big difference between this and this. Look how fuzzy this one is versus how clear this one is. I feel like I'm doing a commercial. Right? I mean, look at that. There's no comparison. For that reason alone, I like to put them in here. Now... The only thing is, a lot of people don't want to deal with the sticky back tape that's on here. You have to peel back. This is this is the biggest drawback of these bags, I believe. And then you have to put it in. Well, there's a lot of ways you can top load it. I, I prefer not to top load it. I know a lot of people do that. I like the side loading, and I'll tell you why in a minute. You slide in, and then you can take the outer flap and you put it over the side and secure it on the back. And once you've done that, I mean, I think it's fair to say this looks a lot sharper than it did when it was in this cloudy bag. Another thing is, these cloudier ones, although they're thick, a lot thicker than these, these will tend to get more and more disgusting as the years go on and dingy and brown and stuff and crispy. These seem to, as far as I can see, always retain their clarity. So a big advantage of this one is that it's very clear. When you look at the album, it can turn almost any album, regardless of quality, into a nice looking, brand spanking new looking album with shrink wrap on it, it looks, because it's so nice like this. What I also like about this is, remember I was talking about flipping the albums. If you flip these albums like this, if you're looking through them in a collection or a box, you're protected here by the bag. The bag is protected all the way around, okay? all four sides. Uh, the other way, if you do I have another one handy, but well, we'll do another who's out we'll, just to compare. I'm going to put this one in the old thicker style, cloudier sleeve. I mean, you can see the difference in the clarity. This is a lot sharper than that. 
Uh, but of course, this, like I said, this one now with the flap is perfectly sealed all around. If for any reason you should have any kind of dust or dirt or any kind of water damage, leaks, I'm not, I was almost going to, just for fun, take these and submerge them in a bathtub. Submerge this one in a bathtub. Well, not these albums in particular. I was going to get some crummy albums I'm looking to throw out and use them as, as dummy examples. And I was going to see what happens if I submerge one in water and the other one in water and see what happens. Obviously, uh, this is going to be more protected. That's the only difference, you know. Uh, that The main thing I don't like is that the old way, although these are sturdier and they slip in nice and they're less of a hassle with the flap, you're not protected by water if you get a, a leaky roof or something like that or anything the water can go right down in there and i don't see what the advantage is so i'm kind of partial to these the clear really clear flap sleeves which i've been using now for well over a year i mean i went back and forth i have a whole closet full of the, the, the thicker cloudy bags which uh i i have uh, put in, in a box I've gone back and forth. I've taken all of these sleeves off and put them in here. Then I've gotten tired of that and taken all these sle outer sleeves off and put them back in here. And I put these in the box and stored them in the closet. I mean, I go back and forth all the time. So it is a dilemma. I'm sure I'm not the only one. Now, so, I, so far, I would say there's more advantages to this than the other. But there is one area where these are really a pain in the ass. And I'm sure everybody who collects these knows what I'm talking about. When you have your records all lined up on the shelves like that and you put them in and you pull them out you run the risk of bending these flaps here on the corner i don't care if i destroy this one just to show you i have i have quite a few on the shelf that are like you want to be bent like and messed up like that because they get caught when you're trying to put them in the, the one big advantage to these when you're doing them on shelves like this is you can slide records in and out take them out to look at them to play them to show them on videos whatever shove them right back in there and there's no problem they just they're both smooth on both sides and there's no flap so there's not an issue that's the thing that keeps getting to me um because i have them like this that's the one thing calling me to go back to these old kinds of outer sleeves well, anyway that's it in a nutshell i'm still having a dilemma i'm thinking now all the records you see there for, for the most part 99 percent of them anyway are all in these clear flap sleeves um i'm thinking because it's such a pain in the neck you know like i said dealing with this flap when you pull them that uh i might go back to the other way of course a lot of people are going to say and i know they do it put the flap on the top some people as i showed you in the beginning don't put them in through the sides they put them through the top like this and then it's not as much of a problem filing them into the cabinet but then i'm glad i remembered this before the video ends problem with that is you know and another disadvantage you have to take the album out in order to play it same thing here when you use these old bags if i want to play this album i've got to put my hands on the record and i got to take the cover out doesn't it defeat the purpose of it being in the plastic i mean what's the point of that you know uh another advantage to the flap is that when i want to play the record I never again have to touch the cover for as long as I have the life of the record. All I have to do is open the side here like that and never touch the, the album jacket, pull the record out like that. Never have to worry about it. So anyway, there's the pros and cons. There's nothing terribly new that I'm sharing here, but uh, I used to have a video on this. I don't anymore, so I wanted to just have this up there just, just to tell you that although I'm, I'm going with the flap sleeves and then the thinner plastic uh my heart pines for these thicker cloudier ones because mainly because they go into the shelf so easily so i've done the pros and cons let me know what you think uh you know there's there's advantages to both of these formats that's the whole thing uh i know that they have these clearer sleeves with top loaders just like just like the, these but the difference with that you know with no flap but the difference with that is still you got to take the album out every time of course there's one other suggestion that somebody once told me put them in this put them in the clear plastic flap sleeves and also put them double bag them which some people do in this once you do this now you can have them all on the shelves you can pull them out and slide them back and forth or you, to your heart's content and the flap isn't going to get caught and then you can still 
take it out of here and you have it doubled up. Hey, I might do that. <laughs>